What's up, my name is Technoba here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be talking about how to fix your start bar or task bar when it becomes unresponsive, you can't click on programs, pull up the start menu and things like that. Do note that if you're running a third party modification software such as Start11 or any other free alternative, they could be causing the issue as they may not have installed properly, they could have corrupted or there could be some other kind of incompatibility with your computer. If this fix doesn't work for you and you're using third party modifications, make sure to check the settings for those to see if you can get anywhere further. First of all, let's try and restart our Windows Explorer. Note we're not restarting Windows entirely, so you don't need to worry about saving everything, but it's a good idea to do so anyways. When you've saved all of your open files, you don't have to close them. Hit Control Shift and Escape on your keyboard to open up the Windows Task Manager. Mine looks a lot different to yours as I'm using an insider version of Windows 11 with a Task Manager Dark Mode. Head across to the Processes tab, wherever that may be in your Task Manager, and look for Windows Explorer. If you don't see it at the very top, hold Start and press E to open up a new file browser. And once a new file browser is open, you should definitely see Windows Explorer. Right click this and choose Restart to close Windows Explorer in the background. Don't worry, it'll keep all of your programs open and it should simply restart. Your start menu should vanish and reappear. And when it does so, hopefully things are fixed here. If they're not for some reason, we can try scanning our computer for any issues. Hold Start and press X to bring up this options menu. On Windows 10, you'll see Windows Command Prompt, Command Prompt or something like that. We're looking for any one of the options with admin in it. In Windows 11, this should be Windows Terminal Admin. And more than likely, yours will be on the other side of the screen. Anyways, inside of here, the first command will be running to go through our Windows system files and make sure that everything is fine and dandy. If any issues are found, they'll be fixed. Type in SFC space forward slash scan now one word and hit enter. This process will take a lot of time, especially if you're on a hard drive instead of an SSD, as it's running through most, if not all, of your important Windows install files, fixing any issues that it could find. When this command is complete, you'll be able to type once more, and you'll be typing in DISM space forward slash online space forward slash clean up hyphen image one word space forward slash restore health as such, and then hit enter. If this finds any issues with your computer, it should hopefully go ahead and try to fix them. But anyways, that's really about it for this quick video. Your issues should most definitely be fixed by now. And if it's not, do check the comments down below as it may be a specific issue with a specific Windows build or other software that you may have installed that could be causing this issue. And if you do find a solution, do leave a comment below to help others. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Techno over here for Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.